Hi, I'm Parker with The Culture Project, and today I'm going to be talking about how and why we as men need to be vulnerable. I remember one time in college, I was really down on my luck. There was all these stress and issues going on that was really starting to get me down. And I knew as I kept dealing with this that I had to confide in someone. So there was a friend of mine that I really trusted and knew that I could talk to. But even then, I was afraid to really let them in on my struggles. Because if I told them, then I had to be vulnerable. And by being vulnerable, they had complete freedom either to reject me or to accept me. And so I did end up telling them. And what they did was accept me with open arms and actually help me through the struggle. And that was the first step in a long line of really getting out of that struggle and becoming better from it. And I think we, as men specifically, really struggle with this issue of vulnerability. Because to be vulnerable necessarily means to take a risk. It necessarily means that that person can either reject you or accept you. That they can either take what you say and throw it to the side or accept it within themselves. And that is a hard struggle because nobody wants to be hurt. But on the flip side of that, everyone actually wants to be loved and seen and accepted. But the only way to do that actually is to be vulnerable. But since it's such a struggle, like how do we do this? I think there's three tips that we can look to in moving forward towards sharing with one another. The first one would be to be vulnerable with ourselves, recognizing that we need other people in the struggles in life, that we weren't made to live this life alone, that we were actually made for communion. And so the more that we recognize that we need to relate with another person, the easier our struggles might become. The second thing would be to find a friend that you know that you can trust. Knowing that that person is not going to reject you, knowing that they will definitely accept you and be with you through thick and thin can be so encouraging. But with that, there's still a risk and it can still be intimidating. But we still have to go out there and put ourselves out there if we ever want the possibility of being accepted and of being loved. The third thing would be specifically with men sharing with one another to find another man to share with. Because we as men have this amazing ability to build each other up for better or for worse. We just continue to feed off of each other and work each other up towards greatness. And so confiding in a man lets you know that that is someone who goes through the same struggles as you do, who lives a similar experience as you and can support you in an all the more intimate way. So if you're struggling with something that you know that you need to share with somebody, take that risk. Do it now, don't wait because the love and acceptance that you can get from that brotherhood starts now and starts with you moving forward and taking that risk of vulnerability. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you click here to subscribe and click here for more videos. Make sure you follow us on social media like Facebook and Instagram. And for more resources, go to thecultureproject.org.